Hi, hello. So suppose that we have four set of four strings. Each four is from a row of square knots. So a row, two rows, three rows, four rows of square knots. And that gives all these strings. Now suppose that you have it in the end of a plant hanging, a Makurami plant hanging. So usually there are several ways of finishing this, but there is one way that I'm going to show you that perhaps is the most beautiful of all and even the most strength of all, the most reliable. That's right. So we can do it for a plant hanging and we can do it for all macrame works that needs in the end to close in one knot. So let's see, what knot is that? That knot actually exists. You see this? This is a Matthew Walker knot. It is a sailor's knot. It is used in a rope. So I've made this artificially rope by hand with this Senate fabric rope that comes comes like this in the market and I've made it by hand a rope, a twisted rope in here there is some tape to close it and then I have made the Matty Walker knot now this Matty Walker knot is a traditional knot and it is described in several books from many years now so what I'm going to show you is a way to use this knot on macrame plant hanging instead of with one strand with several ropes together that make as a unit like this they are a unit because they are several and you can do it with more ropes or less ropes it doesn't matter what is what matters here is the technique so this was the traditional application of the Matty Walker. It is called a rope hand knot. Why? Because you have here a rope and in the end you did, they did, sailors did, a beautiful knot. Now as you can see this knot is really beautiful. Why? Because it has this, the same as this, the same as this and the same as this. So it is completely perfect. The design is perfect. Now I'm going to undo this and I'm going to show you how this is made. This is quite easy and is very useful for macrame artists and especially for those who need to make a knot like this bounding several ropes together. This is really important and easy. So I'm going to undo it. I'm going to take out all these strands from its place. And first I'm going to do it in here because it is easier to learn. And then I'm going to do it with all these strings together. Okay? So first thing to open these strings in here I'm going to make it with three, but in here I'm going to make it with four. It's the same. You can do it with, with two, with three, with four, with five, with six, so on. Okay, so open it like this. First movement to pass each string under the next. So this one under the next. Under. Pull it to the other side because it is worked. This one under. Pull it to that side because it is worked. And this one is going to pass under. Because this is already worked, it is a loop. So this is the easiest thing you can do. Now take attention, don't pull it much so we have it like this. This one is going to pass another under this one, the next. So we have it here, the next is there, over this one that it is already inserted and under this. So you pass it another one, another time, pull it like that. so. <laughs> I had here something <laughs> waiting for us, but it falls. Well, okay, 
no problem. So here is the same movement. We have this one, we pass over this one, and under this one. Here it is. This is very easy, very simple. Pull it, put it like that in that place in here, so you can know that these are worked. And now finally the last one. So over this one, under this one. There is nothing more easy to this. And the knot is made. Now all we have to do is to pass this over, this over, very carefully, and now start to pulling, pulling it, pulling it, pulling it, and pulling it. Now pull it to the center, to the center, alright? Pull this up, so this up, this up, this up, and this up. Now pull it again. When you pull it, you hold this this loop here, and you pull it. Hold this loop, and you pull it. Hold this loop, and you pull it. You have to pull it well. Now, in the end, you need to crawl it. You see it? So, so it, it, it makes this movement, make force to that side. So that these ones, they will keep this in the center as much as possible. And it is made. So as you see, this one, the, the, the round is perfect, the round is perfect, the round is perfect. The round is perfect. If we find anyone that it is different, it is because we have made a mistake. Now these ones, they stay in the center, of course. And that's it. This is a Matthew Walker. And this is a very strong knot. It will never undone. Never undo. Strong, beautiful, remarkable, and reliable. So, let's do in here. This is the important part. So that part was the traditional part. Now this part is the macrame, macrame plant hanging part. First we need to do to put them all together. Don't we have to, to make sure that we don't confuse them. Although it is of no concern because I have already made make this. You see, I have taped it together. This is important. So I've taped it. I've left one so we can see it. How how do we tape it? I've taped all the ends together. In this way, we do not mix all these ropes. So this is again made. This one is still to be made. This one is made, and this one in here is still to be made. So we are going to make it here for all of us to see. First, make sure they are all together. Now take a tape. I have it already here. Cut. Make it diagonal. So you see the tape is diagonal. Now close this first. And now bring it, you see the tape with this finger, and this, and now here you make a small point. You see how good it is? Easy and plain. So we have it with all. This is what was falling to the ground. So this is tape, packing tape or package, package tape, I don't know exactly the name. We are going to tape it provisorily all together so that we so I'm going to tape all these together. As you, you have already understood, now we tape it this tape then it's to take out okay so this is just to keep it here now if we didn't have this separate 
it was impossible to work, right? So we have here one. We have, we have to, to bring them all together, one by one, and separate them after taping, after taping like this, we have to separate them. Just go to the to the end and now bring it. And here it is. So we have these four. Now we take this up. This good idea to make it up and going to open the strands. It is important that the strands are like a flower. Now we are going to do the same movement. So each one under the next, this one under this one, this one under this one, this one under this one, and this one under this one. So we can do it several ways. You see, I'm pulling this one here, hold this one, and this is made. So I'm going to pull this one here, and this is made. Now I'm going to pull this one under this one. Hold it here so it does not collapse. And now the last one, I'm going to pass it to this side so we can see it. And so this one will pass under this one. Because it is already pulled, you see it here, we have to bring it back. You see? Quite easy. And here it is, under. Now in here, we open it again. This is the general effect. So if, if you have this effect, it is okay. So each one passes under the next. Now, these ones that are ins inserted already do not count, all right? We could have this idea, oh, this one passes under one and under two. No, it's not like that. This one comes and passes only under this one because this one is like this and this one is the next. So it passes under the next. This one we have to ignore it because are the ones that, that are already worked. We have to ignore them. Now in here is the same movement as I told you. You pull it, bring the, the, the point, make sure you have a querence here. All right, uh, uh, open clearance so you can see it and not confuse. It is very important to keep it like this. So this one is this one is going to pass under the next. These ones are the next. Just pull it. Now this one is worked. You take it out. Turn the entire work. So this one is going to pass under the next that is from the center always from the center is what counts so passes under pull it and pass it to this side all right now continue continuing to pull it we have to now to pull these ones that are the other ones that are not worked yet pull it to this side so grab this one open it so it, it stays clear. Now this one under this one and passes over this one of course over this one and under this one but for what counts is the movement and the movement is all only under this one and we get to the last one you see it here we have to open it so we do not misunderstand it and here it is and it's like this so here we have our knot. Now it, we can w work it in several ways. It's a good idea to pull it one by one. You see it? It's closing one by one. And now the same. You do it like this. Here it is. And now we are going to pull it. You see here one pair of four, pull it, one pair of four, pull it, one pair, you see, it's only three, so the other one is here, pull it, now the last one, make sure they are always four, you see it, you see how much we can pull, and here we have, now make sure to do the same, 
to pull all this together. Now in here the knot is made, but take a look at this one. This is not well pulled. Why? Because now we have to pull it again 4x4. Four four. Take a good look. Pull it. Make sure we are pulling all the same unit. This is in a bad position for doing this, but hopefully when you, you are working you will be... I saw how much I pulled there. And here is another four. Make sure always that you have the four. Alright. But now we have to pull it one by one. Why? Because this is, is, is a, a set of four, four, four. So now take a good look. Just separate them and we have to pull it one. One, you see, this one. How much it come? So I pull it on all. Put them aside. You see this one does not belong to there. It's only these ones. Four. Now here the same. Pull it. Aha, you saw how much this come. Aha, this one was very slack with a very long slack. This one no. Aha, you saw it? Uh -huh. This is not well made. You see, this was confusing with this one, and this one misses one. Which one is it? Where it is? I'm missing one here. Aha, uh -huh. it's, it's here. So we have to come to the beginning because I'm mix mixing these two. So you, you pull it like this. And let's go and see where they are. Uh -huh, now we have it. Oh, I'm sorry, it was out of the camera. But now we have it. We pull it again. Uh -huh, you saw how much come? This one no. This one no, and this one no. But this one, it has come a lot, right? Now these two, the same. It's a pair of four, so bring it. Didn't come. Uh -huh, this come a lot, right? This a little, and this also a little. Now the last pair, so it's four, make sure you see it's four, and pull it. Uh -huh, this one come a, 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 a long part, this one also, this one also, and this one also. All right, so here you have our beautiful knot. You see how beautiful it is? Although it is made with several. These ones are perfect. These ones are perfect. These ones are even perfect. Parallel side by side. This one's well here. This one passes over this one. But uh, it's not important. Actually, we could uh -huh, even arrange it if we want it. Okay. To make it more beautiful. And perhaps this one. We can even pull it. Is this one? No. So which one is this one? Perhaps it's this one from here. Let's find out. I want to pull this one. If I want to pull it, I pull it back and I see it immediately. But it's it, it's the same. No, it's not that one. No, it's not that one. No, it's not that one. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, I have to pull it. So let, let's find out which one is this one. So if we pull it, you should see it. Huh? Oh my goodness. Comes from here. Oh, of course, it passes under this one and this one. Ah, ha, ha. I was making a mistake. It is not this one that it is need to pull. It is this one. Of course, it is. Remember, we pass it under one. And then you pass it under the other. So this one comes pass under two, this and this, of course. So this one actually is this one. Take a good look. Haha, <laughs> here it is. And this this one, it needs a good pulling. A good pulling, a good pulling, and a good pulling. Okay. I think that this is extremely beautiful for 
a plant hanging. Now of course we can take out this. Here it is. It's a good idea to mix it in a bowl because sometimes ants or small insects they can stay glued in the tape and it's a lot of suffering and we do not want suffering in this world right so in here we have to do like this you take a unit pull it it is okay now you take another unit and pull it it is okay take the other unit and pull it it is okay and this it is okay so you see how good how our plant hanging will stay with this knot this is easy and this is strong and moreover what is really important is a sailor's work and macrame is always a, also a sailor's work so in here you have a perfect way to hold several ropes from several parts in several works and in here I have used only four but you can use as much as you, you want suppose that you have eight in here it's the same to work with four or with two or with one or with eight or with twelve it's the same so we must not let ourselves be confused and that's all and this is beautiful work take a good look remarkably beautiful I'm going to open it just for you to see how perfect it is you see it this is perfect this is beauty and this is safe this knot is much more safe that that thing that you do with another one round here you know because there are several solutions there are many solutions for keeping these ones bounded together but in my humble experience of many many years 20 more 20 and something this one is the best knot for plant hanging and even those who have the wood you know there are some woods with a, ho a hole and then you have these ones this is the knot of choice this is the safest of safest of all knots okay it's a Matthew Walker it is experienced by sailors from the beginning of times that's right I even think that the Romans and the Phoenicians they already use these knots of course I, I I'm not sure I cannot prove it but probably yes and that's all thank you so much for watching and I hope that uh, you are you are happy because I think that these knots, in fact, they are very effective and uh, they, they should be known, you know. These were knots, as I told you, they were sailor's knots and they are still sailor's knots. But Mukrami needs these knots. I don't understand why does Mukrami does not use these knots. It's, uh, it's something that uh, blows my mind, you know. Because in the beginning, sailors, they did a lot of macrame. I even think that macrame was invented by sailors. It's not, well, it's a theory. I cannot prove it also, but it is a theory. That's right. So, if they invent it or not, well, it's not important anyway. The fact is that sailors use it and they mix it with the knowledge of knots that is the best in the world there are no activity in this world that have more experience in better knots than sailors knots so thank you so much for watching thank you really thank you and i hope you can use these with very success in your works and i hope that uh, once it is learned you know once it is learned it is easy to do as you see just pass it, pass it under and then under again and that's it there is nothing more to this there is no science it is not a rose knot rose knot is much more difficult but this one is plain for everybody thank you so much